How's it going? This is Drew from Eminem Maple Grove doing a video on shutting down a rig uh, of this size. Uh, this is particularly for divided pans with a drawer off, but it'll it'll relate to any kind of shutdown really. Uh, the idea is that you, number one, you always want to make sure you have plenty of sap to shut down. Uh, it takes me about an hour to shut down, uh, so usually when I get to about five gallons of concentrate, I know it's it's you know it's getting to that point. So uh, what I do is. The, the, the key is to, like I said, keep that, that, that flame really hot. So at one point, you just start moving your logs around, uh, getting, them, you know, getting them to burn up, and then just loading smaller pieces of wood. Things are going to burn up by the time uh, the, the coals are, are pretty much uh, have been burned out as well. So uh, we'll go into the, the firebox right now, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. And uh, you know, basically, first what you do is you kind of just you're shifting everything around. Uh, and then, you know, it, determine whether you need to load more wood at that point. So, you kind of want to just get, get your fire going. And then, you know, I might throw in just a couple of these small pieces, you know, just something that's going to, you know, burn right up um, by the time uh, everything dies out. Because uh, you don't want to be caught uh, with too much, too much wood, too much heat at the end, because it, um, you know, it, it kind of screws up the system. So the idea, of what you want to do is you want to draw as much sweet off as you can um, so you're not uh, starting off with uh, a lot of syrup in the pan so it, it makes it a lot um, a lot easier for starting up next time uh, if you do this procedure and the idea is basically you know you're, you're keeping your fire as hot as possible but you're, you're drawing off uh, you're constantly drawing off I gotta open this up a little bit. Um, you're constantly drawing off, and then you, you get to the point where you're gonna go past where you would normally draw off from. And the idea is you wanna get as much sweet out of the pan as possible. Uh, so it, what happens is it actually, you'll be drawing off faster when you start up again. And the, the goal is to be able to leave the pan at actually a lower level than you actually boil at. So once you go and start filling your pan again, you're going to push all the, the denser, sweeter uh, material to where you want it at the end, and you'll be drawing off faster again. So um, you know that's the concept. It's a it's a it's a delicate balance between uh, when to load it, you know, at the end, and how much to load it. And you know, at one point, it's like I'll be throwing in like one or two sticks, small, tiny sticks, just to keep that hot flame. Um, and then the idea is usually what I'll do is uh, I'll, I'll I'll I I have I know when how much I could flood my pan. So when and then I'm, I, you know, when I'm comfortable walking away, you know, from it at that point, uh, and then you know when I come back, it's usually like I said, it's usually you know right at the level, a little you know, the goal is a little level lower than the level of what you start. Uh, one other um, procedure you can do when you start up, if you wind up with a higher level than you really want to, I just siphon out, you know, a certain amount from this side of the pan, uh, throw it right into my preheater, bring it down to the level you want, you know, you want to start off, so you're not starting off with a much higher volume than um, than required, and it'll be a lo much longer time to get to that uh, oil time. So, uh, I hope these uh, these pointers helped. Uh, questions, comments, feel free to leave them. And uh, thanks for watching.